Welcome to another Chaos. Big fan and longtime sub. Figure out step in for your official Frank hot take on the Chaos draft. What say you? Uh, I actually think that's our. I've done one. And I feel like everyone's kind of on a level playing field, so that's kind of nice. Uh, let's find out with this Dragons of Tarkir pack. Welcome back to another Chaos Draft here on Magic Online slash the internet slash YouTube slash Frank Uh What do we take, Michael? You know all these commander cards, don't when you? Enchanted creature attacks. You may create a token that's a copy of the token. Ooh, that does not seem that great. If they didn't get exiled, that'd be MVP, right? Uh, put one on counter each dragon you control. Yeah, that's not great. I think it's just ultimate price. Yeah, I mean that's a good one. How do you go wrong with ultimate price? They have multicolored creatures. All right, getting off that. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but, you know, I still don't think it's... Actually, I went to pre-order this last night. I, cl I clicked on it again, just randomly. And uh, GameStop did have some in stock. So I, I think they are refreshing these. So I might be able to pre-order one if it, if it if the moment comes. We'll see. And I got these both up for you. Well, it'll take too long to ship. Are you just leaving them up so I remember the name of them so we can try to get them locally? Oh, yeah. Obviously. Just okay. remember which what we're, what we're looking at here. Also, for those interested, Mike did say he was interested in doing a drunk stream on Friday. So, if you guys are... Get your get your tickets to the, to the, to the drunk show. Uh, Chasm Skulker is actually pretty good. Yeah, I think it's good enough to take. Yeah, it just sits there and, and gets some get some counties. Frog snip? There's literally one frog in the pack. That's a salamander, okay? No, behind under it. Which is familiar. Oh. That's definitely a frog. I thought you guys were being froggist and calling the salamander a frog. Yeah, I'm just gonna take this. There was also a looter in that pack that you gotta pay four mana to loot with. That's a good deal. Old Man River, he don't say nothing, but he respect. <laughs> respect. Sometimes he's got to dab. Dab on them Old Man Rivers. Just about to win my last round. Empty Joe freezes and won't allow. Oh, fantastic. Whenever you cast the Spirit or Arcane spell, each other creature control gets plus one, plus one against Trample. That's good, but, I mean, we're going to have, like, two Spirits in our deck. We could just do a good old Arcane Mine Rot. Eh, commie mage. Oh, we're not. We're not really white though. Look at the top card of your library. Oh God, that's such garbo. It's not good. Return another creature you control from, or another creature card from your hand. These are all pretty bad. Yep. It's like this format was bad. I did not like. Yeah, I think we just picked something in like. Sacrifice any number of lands, add that much mana. The value. I'll just take this 4-4 four, four for 4. Yeah, I think that's fine. Whatever. Squid Horror. Oh, there we go. Now this is a good pack. Cloud Rider Sphinx is your boy. We also got a Yargle. He's come to Bargle. I think it's Sphinx. Yeah, definitely. No sneak attack. Uh, do, 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 do. My name is Michael. Counterflux. Archweaver. Archweaver. We got a Golgari long legs. That's how I used to call your mom in college. Did you? Did you? Seven mana. Oof. Yeah, five mana for a five four seems okay. Look, we got another Mind Rot. If that other one comes back, we can just have Mono Mind Rots. Is Yargle a spirit? That's interesting. Yeah, he's a frog spirit. This guy's black or green, so depending on if we're blue-black or blue-green. We got a lot going on here. It's like two picks in one. Two, two, two picks in one. Two picks in one. Oh, yeah, yeah. What is this here? 
no crying out loud. So it's a 3-3 attacker, but it does cost 4. Sacrifice a goblin, destroy a land. Ugh. This guy's garbo. When you cycle it, elf creatures, all of them get plus 2, plus 2. So it literally could be none. It's just 4-7 with cycling. Pew, 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 pew. That's what I, I feel that guy. Is this guy? Yeah. Isn't this guy just better? Costs one more so. and he's a little bigger, but you can cycle him. I guess. Six mana is a lot for a 3 6. I don't think I care about that, man. I'm going to be honest with you. Pick good cards, build a deck later. That seems rough. I do like a recover. Yeah. But are we green or are we black or are we blue? I think we're definitely blue. We could just splash this ultimate price. Yeah, it's got to be like Recover. It's like the only good card in this pack that we can even remotely consider. Can you guys hear that? Because Felipe always puts his lawn around when I'm streaming, so. Might want to shut that door. But I'm dancing to it. Alright, we'll dance to it, and then whenever you're done. No, no rush. Eh. Eh. Oh, actually, Expel is pretty good. Return a permanent. If you have the City's Blessing, you put it on top instead. That's actually yeah, fine. Yeah, that's good. The white noise is relaxing. Man. <coughs> uh, I don't stream in my laundry room, but... I feel like that'd be louder if I streamed in the laundry room. Alright. I'll close the door real quick. Peace out, buddy. I'll see you later. Plus O plus three and hex proof, that could be fine. There we go. That actually seems pretty good. Whenever a creature enters a battlefield, you may attach this to it for its plus one plus one for that's actually pretty good. Yeah, Felipe does laundry in the in the steam room. Stream room. Steam room? Steam room, huh? Mmm, steam hay. Steam ham? Look, we can still make our frog deck. You know this you don't know the steam hams mean? Steam hams? Yeah. No, I don't think so. It's from Simpsons. Really? Mm-hmm. Mmm, steam hams. Huh. Old Man River. Whenever you cast a spirit or a cane spell, target land becomes a three three. And you are a two mana one one. And we have one spirit. I'll take you because I'm not gonna play anything else, and maybe you get there, but I doubt it. Corrosive ooze or blood tallow candle? Probably blood tallow candle, right? It's removal. Nope, oh, this is a pack. Okay, let's just take a little Lizzie. Mike, don't call yourself a ham. <laughs> I mean, this does kill... No, this is a human cleric. Wow, what a piece of junk. It can't even sacrifice itself. Oh, wow, that's terrible. Yeah, you gotta sacrifice a goblin. Ooh, Imperiosaur. I think that's the pick, actually. There's nothing else good in here. Aether Snipe's pretty good. It's either Aether Snipe or Imperiosaur, I think. What up, Don Amek? Good seeing you, buddy. Just kidding, just kidding. We have a good time. You feel like either snipe a little better? I do too, actually. I was going to say, plus we can probably get another Imperiosaur, but that's not how this draft format works. We may never see them again. Turning the beat around. Oh, Ink Moth Nexus. Get that Infect. Whenever a source deals damage to Nested Ghoul, make a 2-2 two -two zombie. Meh. Mountain Walk. A 2-3 Mountain Walker. For three. Sure. 
Whenever you cast an artifact, you may untap it. Sure. None of these cards are very good. You are correct. Maybe you just think about Nexus. A three color deck though? I don't know if we're necessarily green. We have our Shut up. <laughs> Got him. You guess that guy? Ugh. Or the hound. That thing seems terrible. Whatever. I took the ghoul unintentionally. This is just a 3-1 flyer. I think this is actually fine. And by finding me, it's probably pretty good. Hornet Harasser is also a card. I think Luna's Prowler is pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to go with the Prowler. That's a 3-3. Three Three, three power flyer and limited. Pretty okay. And if you want to discard cards, by all means. Knock your face off. That's the saying, right? By all memes. Whenever an artifact enters the battlefield under your, patrol, under your control, you may tap a permanent. Yeah, Luminous Angel's pretty insane if we were white. Don't think we can be white though. I guess we could just regress. Yeah. It's not great though. We already have an expel. I mean, it's fine. Whatever. So we're taking regress over luminous. Old man Michael. That is what I am. No way, you're spring chicken, Michael. I don't spring no chickens, buddy. Okay. We can tap seven druids to gain control of all lands they control. Cool. <laughs> Neat. <laughs> uh, when this enters the battlefield, look at the top card. Don't care about that. When this guy, you can just put this guy on the top. This is actually hard to deal with. Yeah, I'll take this guy. 3-2 flyer. Sure. Fits in the curve pretty well. That old man river, though. This format's so weird. You're weird. Wow. Got him. Wow. I think mirror was better than the regret. Maybe. I mean, it was off color. I don't know. If there was a mirror that said add a colorless mana to your mana pool, probably decent. Oh, a bunch of blue cards here. Target creature gains flying to end of turn. Return target land to its owner's hand. This is a nudie tootie. Nudie tootie. Oh, nudie. <laughs> You can take a flyer, right? Yeah, and bounce a land. That's not bad. We can go turn three regress, turn four Avon Fogbringer, and just tempo him out. Oh, new day. New day, two day. All right, what do we got here? When enters the battlefield, gain control, target artifact, and yeah, that's probably not going to be. End of the turn, activate this ability only during your turn. <laughs> oh, I'm done! Chain of creature gains flying. It might just be this. We could actually steal some pretty decent artifacts, I imagine. Yeah. Nightmare, Nightmare Salamander Beast, that's what I used to be. What's in your nightmare, Salamander head? Elite Arcanist. When it enters the battlefield, you may exile an instant from your graveyard, from your hand. Copy it. You may cast the copy without paying the mana cost. X is the converted mana cost of the exiled card. So you're still paying the mana cost. It's also a 1-1, one, one, so like they're like, oh, kill it. But you can do it over and over again, and you only cost 6 mana for a 1-1. One, one. <laughs> <clears throat> well, it's 4, but still. What? Oh, 
That's a little better. What? What? Oh. Oh. Water Serpent's pretty good. Oh. Oh. That's a fighter. It's just basically an Aetherling. Traumatic Visions? I'm not sure about that, but okay. It's basically Aetherling. I'll take a Visions. Five mana counter spell. Wow. I mean, it's got, it's got land cycling. Boy, do it. What? I said, boy, do it. What? Okay, well. Oh, no, a flappy flap. Mike looked up in the air and said, oh, no, a flappy flap. <laughs> but you know uh, this thing, right? Yeah, that's fine. I know. Just I know. Annoying. Hey, look, a fairy. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Should force Salamander Tribal. That would bring Mike too many memories of his family. I don't think so. Mike comes from the Salamander Tribe. I see. know so. Wow. Molten Rain? Get him? I don't think we're getting anybody with Molten Rain. I'll be honest with you. Molten Rain. Molten Rain. I never meant to cause your lands any trouble. Never meant to cause them any pain. Molten rain. Molten rain. It's a tough choice, man. It does. <laughs> it's not, but... Alright. Oh, wow. Two of the... Uh... Yeah, I'll just take this guy. It's 2-1. It can get Shroud and can't be blocked. That's decent. Mountain. Solid. Oh, Sul Suleiman's Legacy. I'm not reading that. I know it's bad. I'm not. We're not even going to ever pick that. Shimmering Afrit. Three mana with phasing. Whenever it phases in, target creature phases out. When I phase in, you phase out. When I phase, you phase, you phase. Oh, two you phases. That's pretty good. Return two target creatures to their owner's hand. That's two boops. That's pretty good for three. three for three, that actually is pretty good. Yeah, I think that's probably the best card in this pack. Yeah, two boops is pretty good. It says destroy all gins. Could be relevant. Hmm. Hmm. Destroy the gin. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was... That was something. <sighs> destroy the gins. <laughs> Get them. Sometimes you just gotta get those gins. Destroy all artifacts and enchantments. Hmm. Hmm. For five mana, you say. Hmm. Oh wow. Deals one damage to any target. Ooh. Combo. Yeah, I mean SWAT's good, miscalculation's good, but this seems broken. Also, it's just a pinger, and and pingers are amazing in limited formats. Combo! The combo's connected to the mic bone. Is it? Go, Gary. Chocolate. Cinnamon. Strawberry. Rappleberries. Boysenberry. Schnickleberry. Salamander. <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. This pack is not that good. <sighs> we don't have any artifacts, so this is not great. This guy is just worse than this guy, I think. I think we just want another two drop. I think Dune is operative is fine. Dune operative. Dune. Yeah. Wow, I like that this is just strictly better than this. Yep. Pithing Needle. Uh -huh. Oh, Ponder. I like a Ponder. Sure. Sure. <laughs> so you're playing Sultai. Well, technically, it's kind of like a little... It's a little Sultai cheat. 
Can you have an arcane adaptation named Jin, then donate your arcane adaptation to your opponent and use Sylvan's legacy as a one-sided? Uh, sure. Maybe. I'm somewhat of a scientist myself. <laughs> I like to dabble in the sciences myself. You see. Four mana regenerate this idiot. We also got exalted. But dark favor though. Hmm? Yeah, these are both shit. How do we get this stupid set again? I guess we'll take this idiot. Purple Mike. Did you ever go to the dentist? Not yet. I need to call. Call now. What's Monk a gun? Is that a Pepe with a gun? Pepe Le Pew? Pepe the Frog. I'm just gonna take Weave Fade here. I like drawing two cards. Yeah. Yeah. I never meant to cause you any trouble. Molten rain. Molten rain. Probably take Candle out for now. Really? I mean, what are we going to cut? Storm Rider Rig? Why? This is really good. Old Screechy Pants. Oh, Vithian Stinger? Wow, that's a late Vithian Stinger. I think I'm just going to take that and if we on the off chance that we get a way to splash a red guy. Move on. <laughs> this is also a good pinger. Man. What about that weird sea fish over there? The shipwreck moray that is energy based. I'd probably just take this six this 4 3 flyer. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably the best thing we could do. Michael B. Just so you know, do not ever bring on a non-mic guest in your mono mic mic stream. Guest WTF phone. You know, Matthew Ari, there's only so long that you can blame the phone, buddy. Our deck is pretty much done. We need one cut. What are we cutting? I've got a phone, Greg. Can you correct me? Can I correct you? Mm -hmm. No, I can't. Who can? My dad. <laughs> Good lord. Oh, man. You want to read it? No. Destroy all the... Destroy the djinns and afrites. When a djinn or defreet enters the battlefield, destroy it. It can't be regenerated. Wow. Man, they're really hating on those djinns and defreets back in the day. Those what? Djinns and defreets. Djinn. Djinn. <laughs> Dijin. Dinjin? Did you say Dinjin? We're done here. Good talk. Good talk. Yeah, that's crazy to me. I always reread what, what I send before I type usually. I can't be bothered. Yeah, I always read every single time. I want to make sure what I'm sending is what I want to, what I intend to mean. Right? Like if I send something and then it's wrong and then you like if I'm like, "Hey, I'm going to the store today. I'll be at this address." And then the address is wrong. Like that's on me, not the phone. We got to make one cut. What's our cut here? 
Probably that stupid counter spell. Traumatic vision? Yeah. I'm gonna be a hater. Or you could, or you could cut the thief and board it in. Board it in. I like that. I like that better. I'll never drop the D. What's the D? Oh, for the gin? Yeah. For the Dijon? What did you call it? Dijon, it? Dijon mustard? Yeah, he loves a good Dijon mustard. 11-4, wow. That's ambitious. I'm just going to go 9-8. Double black, double black. Oh, there's forest in there. Oh, I see the problem now. Alright, we did it. Let's do it. Purple rain. Uh, KF, dra KF drafts are where every pack is a random pack from a random set. Also, don't forget Mike's mom is also a random pack from a random set, so... This is true. Oh, we're playing 42. What? What? Hold on. Okay. How'd that happen? That's weird. I don't know. Because I took... I... Huh. So it randomly gave us two forests too many. No, I think it. we didn't take those out. I think I lowered the amount. I added the amount. I know I wanted 9-8, right? So I raised the amount of swamps to, to 8, and then I lowered the amount of islands to 9. Um, And by doing so, I actually added two extra lands after I took the forests out. Oh, sure. Or before I took the... Yeah, after I took the forests out. Yeah, okay. It's not great. It's kind of expensive, but it'll get the job done. We'll win the game. Right? Yeah. Or we won't. Oh, no. Then we'll die. Then we will die. <laughs> Oh, those are good. They only auto-equip to artificers, though, so... Here comes an artificer. Nope, that's just a spirit. That's just a ghost dad. Just a spinooch? Yeah, just a spinooch. Everybody knows a little spinooch. I know several spinooches. I had a spinach once. <laughs> Should I just bop him? Me. I mean, we can get in there. They didn't play a guy. I'm gonna bop him. Because if we get a land, we go f this guy, and if we get another land, we go this guy. I guess we could have drawn cards, too. So many things to do. Take a look. It's in a book. My name's Juposhi. Do you like how I added a little Juposhi in there? Little J. Is this Bushido's on blocking and attacking? Yeah, yeah that's pretty good. Oh! Put this on top, and I'll put this on top, too. I want both of these. So I guess we're not attacking here. Man, our poor Cephalid. He's so outclassed at every turn. And it was an uncommon. He'll play something better than one one, but this creature also makes combat really, really hard. All right, well... Surprisingly good right here. Hey, wanna play boss? Oh my god. Oh wow, fantastic. Yep, you have the better Kalish block card. Hmm. 
Yep, just gonna pass here, keep up dissipate and weave fate. Do I wanna dissipate or do I wanna weave fate? Don't incorrectly sing the safety dance song and non karaoke safety dance stream. Alright, that's fine. I don't care about that nerd. How rude of you. Why? Why wouldn't you care about him? Why would I? He has to give me a reason to care. I can't just I'm not gonna randomly just care about it. So that's that's your brother. No. Wow, so messed up. What is? He's your own brother and you talk to him like that? I ain't my brother. <laughs> <laughs> Did you like that? That ain't my brother. He's my brother. Is this just a 4-3 for this 3-5? This seems like a good trade if we can get away with it. Oh my god. Get your junk out of here and we'll just trade a one for one. That was a good old deal. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We are one away from City's Blessing. No dogs allowed. We can probably just wait. Draw two cards. Why not just attack with this guy? Could also do that. I mean, I like attacking with 5 4. That's a 5 4, good buddy. Yeah, I'll take three. Yeah. Yeah, take three. Yeah. Yeah, that's a Toyota. I thought it was a Chevy. For negative one counter, you may tap or untap that creature. I thought it was a Chevy. You know, why don't you shut up? <laughs> why don't you just shut up? Let me hit you again. <laughs> That's from that's Mike from the darker timeline. Under the sea. I kind of just want to bounce this guy now. Mm, no. Because now it goes on the top. No, ascend. Yeah, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, all right, cool. Library, obviously. <laughs> I was like, why isn't it? Why don't I have it now? Yeah, that's fine. I don't care about that guy. I don't care about your stupid idiot. You alright, man? I'm dying. You should really fix your life choices, man. How about you do that? I'm doing quite well. Mm hmm. That's what they all say. Who's the who? The people. Dude. The people. Do they? Hit them in the head with a rock. Burp, burp. Hit them in the head with a rock. <laughs> Who are we hitting in the head with a rock? Somebody. Fascinating. F -f 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 Fascinating. Yeah, get him. I am getting him. Get him a body bag. A buy bag? A body bag. Get him a boy bag, eh? Put on the top. 
of the library. I think I'll just, actually that's fine. I don't care about all that. Oh, I guess rod now. I can't do it. Dang. That's fine. Could our world hand a reverse Mike B? No, probably not. That's pretty bad. Ten bits with a link in it. If this is a link, I don't want to click it because I don't want to get demonetized. Not a song should be safe. Oh god. Alright, I'll click it then. Oh my god. Gotta do it now. One, two, three. So this gets count countered too, but we did force the hand. So they have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten power on board. We have a blocker. So if we can actually fade a removal spell, then we can survive. They can also put a counter on this guy and tap it. And then we take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, go to one. This guy actually ended up being pretty pretty ridiculous. He's just going to win us the game, this unblockability. Which is pretty surprising. Don't laugh, man. Keep going. You're really... There used to be a Mike B Tower alone on the sea. Cephalid Illusionist just won the game for me. It's Ink Shroud, not Illusionist. I actually didn't even call him the right name. Wow. And love became... But did you know... Did they have Artifact? They, were, they did, didn't we? Didn't they? Didn't we, they? Didn't we, they? Make me feel some kind of we, they? <clears throat> I think this match went well. And by match, I mean game. <laughs> you should check your seal? I don't know what that means. What's even happening right now? Oh, my... Because it's seal. I got you. Like a window seal. No. That's a, that's a sill. Those are two different words. Oh, man. Window seal. No, man. It's not... It's not a seal. <laughs> I'll die on this hill. I think we kind of want these. I think we do. I think we can do better, though. That turned out well. All I really wanted was one, so...
Well, that's pretty good. Can't be blocked as long as the fighting player controls the artifact. All right, well. That is a powerful wizard. Do you think 8 rack could ever be tier 1? Probably not. No. I mean, if it's not tier 1 now, it's probably not going to become tier 1. Right? Like, it's not just going to randomly be tier 1 one day. The problem is there's the decks that just kind of run out of all their creatures too fast. I didn't actually care about that, but I just can't... I'm not going to have time to sit here and keep that in my hand. So even if you put this on, like they still attack for four each turn, it's pretty brutal. This guy gets float and this guy is unblockable. Good lord. Why? I might just cycle for a black source here. And by that I mean a swamp. They're called swamps. You're called swamp. You're called a stupid idiot, you dummy. Got him. Wow. Did got you? Em. Yeah, bro. You got got. I'm not so sure. How, when, how will you know for sure? Only time will tell. No, oh, can't block. La 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 da 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 da. Would him to be too strong for modern? Yeah, probably. Him to Tarak is a very, very oppressive magic card. Being random is super ridiculous. Oh, we get the Clash? Avon Fogbringer. Uh, I'm going to put you on the bottom. What did they hit? Okay. Uh, I think if they tie, they win. It's just as if you win, put a 1-1 one, one counter on it. So you actually have to win. Bottom. Did they put this on top? Yep, yeah, that's a good one. Interesting. They just have too many guys. We can't actually put any pressure on here. My power, my pleasure, my pain. To me, you're like a grown addiction that I can't deny. What are you doing over there, man? You picking out your eyeball? Yeah, there's like a hair. To my eyeball. Can't get rid of it. Yeah, there is a hair. Nope, that's on your little nope, cheek. Nope. That's yeah, just cheek. pull that thing out, man. I can't find it, man. It's hard to find the hair. You gotta go in a mirror. You gotta look in an actual mirror and they'll they'll show you. Mirrors will show you things. If you remove your eyes, you can't have eye problems. That's true. I don't have any, uh, there's no argument against that, actually. I'm bringing this candle.
Mirrors will show you things. <laughs> oh, man. Michael B. Yes? Can I help you? You can't help anybody. Wow. Get wrecked, you friggin' nerd. Michael B. Where we're going, we don't need eyes to see. <laughs> that was really, uh, that was a real back to the future right there. Wow, every game. It's impressive. You steal it this time. I will steal it. Don't tell me what to do. Embrace the darkness. Oh, every game with this guy, too. My god. It's funny, we make it unblockable by actually, uh... By actually stealing their artifact. Maybe we don't, then. Oh, I want to get the click down first, because I think it's just stronger. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Alright. Now I think we might. Now I'm still gonna... Um, yeah, playing this on... Five might be better. No, they're playing blue white. What can they do? In before they do something really degenerate. You can Gideon's whatever it and deal it three or something. They didn't, so no worries. None. Not not one worry. Undo is gonna be nice. Boom 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 boom. Oh yeah, bouncing both of those bros coming at you live. Bouncy boys. Show me your beebles. If you like it, then you should have put a beeble on it. A beeble, you say? A beeble, bro. What's a beeble, bro? <laughs> That's a beeble, bro. Mm. Oh, there are beebles. Yeah. Do the beebles weeble, but they don't fall down? You do. Hmm. Peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly. Peanut butter jelly on Mike's butt. face. I'd, I'd be okay with it I'd, then I'd eat it you'd eat your face? I'd eat the peanut butter jelly on my face dear god now we can counter something I know we can feeling good in the neighborhood We know their other card is that prevent damage guy, so. You should definitely eat your own face on stream. <laughs> you heard it here first. Oh, that's pretty good. And that's an art of Fossario. Oh. Interesting. You can't have deft dismissal because you don't have four mana. We know one of your cards is the creature. Did you want to tap one of my guys? I feel like that's what you wanted to do. Okay, well. That's worse. Because you're still taking five now, and we get to play a big floaty boy. I'm not going to move that over. Because then they can just kill this guy. Yep. Just going to play this first. 
Maybe we'll hit an ultimate price. Ooh, Chasm Skulker. A 1-1 one, one when they have a put a 1-1 one, one counter on your guy guy. The problem is all three of our guys are lethal except for this one. So they have to block here. They trade, and that's actually a pretty good trade. Yeah, we have to get rid of the Prevent 2 guy, though. I kind of just want to put this on here instead, because, like, they're both 1-1s. One and they're both lethal. Do we play land this turn? Oh, we did. Dang. But, like, if you're using this guy to tap this guy down... Even if you play a guy... Oh, I guess you can block here and then put a counter on this guy. But then, like, you actually have to do it before I draw the card or else it's a 2-2. Two -two. Alright. Our deck's pretty sweet. This is where the 3-0 comes. Did Caleb get really excited by getting that hot Frank raid and it never happened? I have no idea what that means. What are you saying right now, Walladale? What a weirdo. I'm gonna ban Walladale. Wow. I don't think he needs to be in the chat anymore. Rude. Oh shit, I thought he didn't mean to say that live. I thought we were... I thought the mic oh, were off. Oh dang, I made a terrible mistake. Have you been venomized? My dad was. Oh. Hmm. My dad. Tell me more about this no. dad. God, my stir cons is out of date again. Dang. Every, every week, man. This hand is great. This only costs five of the Storm Rider wig. Rig. Wig. Wig, 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 wig. Really? This is how you going to be? How's it going to be? Oh, boy. Also, Monka S, please no Banarino, me dad Arino. <laughs> What's Machna S? I don't know what that is. Man, this hand's just getting better and better. Till it doesn't. What is this? Remove three counters, draw a card. Sure, that's fine. Draw two, two cards. cards. Snoozlemuth. Thanks so much, man. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Should I do it? Bounce one, <laughs> dude. No. Uh, yeah, you're right. I was just kidding. Did you like the head up? <laughs> I did. <laughs> Water servants coming down soon. You ready? You mean? I mean water servant, Michael. It's not complicated. A filling. Oh, draw two cards and discard? That seems bad. That's a poor man's divination. At sorcery speed, no less. That's a catalog. At a catalog. Is it? That's paddling. I will 100% equip my rig. 4-5, that gets a little pumperino. Yes, please. This is where they go mind control. You ready? I'm waiting for it. Antler Skulkin is what they discarded. Huh. Target white creature gains persist until end of turn. That's weird. Yep. What a weird piece of garbage. All the scarecrows are pretty weird. That's scarecrowist. It ain't wrong, though. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> it might be. It might be wrong. That's a good boy. I think we're going to bounce, bounce. Bounce, 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 bounce. No. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Still no. Bounce, 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 bounce. Actually, I kind of just want to expel this guy. And play a Shrouder. Yeah, but what if we had our... Oh, it doesn't matter. Bouncing token. 
Yeah, I'll put it on the top. Why don't you wait until you get the city's blessing? Shut up, nerd. How oh, rude. It's rude that you're a nerd. <laughs> what up, the awesome Delp? Ba -dum -bum 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 -bum. What are you doing here? Make a decision. I don't know what you're doing. You dancing? This is the Regress Edition. It's a song about business. <laughs> Putting guys back in your hand, got every cephalid wishing. Bounce, 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 bounce. What you got? You scratching your little leg over there, man? Yeah. Oh, my leg has scratches because I have lice. Yeah, I have lice on my leg. The old leg lice. You got leg lice? Yeah. Also known as Legolice. I was I was like, man, I loved him in fucking uh, Legend Legend of the Rings. I like that I call it Legend of the Ring. <laughs> <laughs> Legend of the Ring. I actually couldn't think of the name for a second. I was like, dang, what's it called? I'm just discard a card here, attack with both, and then we can. If we don't have to regress, we can play Winkin Rider. Peace out, bro. We improvise. Oh, no. What does this guy get? I don't care about that. Yeah, I'll put this on you. Sure. It's better to have a big boy than no boy at all, if you know what I mean. That's true. I have no idea what that means. He's got to wind you, boy. They didn't kick? Oh, I guess it doesn't matter, right? <laughs> I'll give these guys float. Can we just undo? I think we do. You think we do? Undo. undo. Wow. 5, 6, 7, 8, and 10. Actually, I kind of want you to block with something good, right? Sorry about your Lego lice. It's okay, man. Hmm. I'll get over it. Will you? Guess I'll deal you 10 here. Aren't you dead on board of this, this guy again? Well, his name is Dr. Stupid, so... <laughs> I guess that's fair.
Big fan, been following on YouTube, finally upgraded to the Twitch thing of Bob. How are you enjoying? It's all right so far. We're 2 1, and we're up a game here, up a match, so. You know, no complaints so far. There's your little Hawkums. So the thing is, if they tap out for the other guy, then they're pretty much dead to this guy, right? Oh, they didn't do it. That's a little Prowly. I was going to actually... Oh. Mr. Prowly. Burr, burr, burr. You know that song? Yeah. They got to have something here, right? Oh, all right. Well, discard Mr. Prowly. Even if they have a removal spell, I just discard this, right? This card's pretty bonkers. Giving Shroud and can't be blocked is... P good. It's not, it's not bad. We didn't see any artifacts, right? Nope. I think we're just good like this. I have no problem with our deck. Come on, buddy. Dr. Horrible. Dr. Horrible. You know that song? Phone call for Mr. Horrible. What is that? They might be giants? Does Ponder make this hand keepable? No. <laughs> really? What if we draw just nothing but gas? We're on the draw? You're crazy. No. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. You won't be punished. doesn't matter. I only get punished when I actually make good decisions. When I make bad decisions, Magic's like, keep doing it! That's a great draw. I won't argue that. <laughs> Never punished. <laughs> Keep it all. All right, what order do we want this in? We're going to draw Expel. But next turn, we want Chasm Skulker. Yeah, we're just going to have all these by three anyway. That's beautiful. To be fair, I would have probably kept that hand in Commander. I think Commander, you have a lot more time, though, right? Yeah. Well, I'll change my username. Did I frankly answer my question about the first draft? What was the what was the question, Greasy Cleric? Greasy Cleric? Who are you now? Who were you and who are you? Gets plus three. Oh, so this is just an 0-4 with Delirium? All right, that's fine. Oh, man, getting this guy down early is pretty good. And the squids have... They're also green-white, so unless they have, like, a swords, he's probably getting on the distance. I don't know what... Swords is pretty rare in this, right? It's only, like, in, like, Vintage Masters or something. K 
Chasm Skulker. Greasy Cleric, you were the awesome Delp? <gasps> what a time to be alive. All right, I'll have to keep this in mind then. More like the awesome Cleric, am I right? No. Um, eh? No. No? No. I'm actually super hungry right now. Yeah, me too. What did I eat today? I had like nothing. I've had I coffee. had some breakfast, That's really. It. Yeah, it was like eight hours ago, though. Uh, attacking creatures you control of death touch not not good times put a plus one plus one counter on target creature that's also very good deals two damage to a creature with flying gaining three life those are all very good yeah bow is pretty good bow knows how did he get because he sacked that thing no the other thing he did that oh he reinforced okay I had I was like, wait, why did he get this counter? What is happening? Well, I guess we're attacking for dose here. Alright, deals two to a flyer? Yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, this guy's fine then. I'm gonna keep up dissipate, we'll take another hit. Might bounce this guy. Where the metas are made up and the synergies don't matter. <laughs> oh, good times. I cracks through. It's a league so that you draft your cards with the same eight people. You are seven other people. Uh, but once your deck is drafted, you just enter the queue and you'll be paired against who's ever also in the queue and also in a league. So uh, you draft with the same people, but you may have you're gonna you're likely gonna play against people that are that are not from your pod. I'm not tempted to bounce this guy now, but I'll keep the dissipate up. Like, our plan is to play this guy next turn. I don't think we need to bounce it. I think you're probably right. Man. Chasm Skulker. Remember that time we kept that six land ponder hand? I remember. Let me tell you how good Ponder is, man. Ponder is a good card. So is Scrying both of these to the bottom. I do not need lands 8 and 9. Old man Michael. That's me. Is it? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Reprisal? Oh, okay. Okay. Combo! Still took his whole turn and he had to like waste his activation. Oh. Don't forget, he has death touch. No, only attacking, right? Attacking creatures you control oh. death touch. This is actually pretty sweet. You ready for the combo? C -c -c combo! Neck bones connected to the combone! Combones connected to the fat old chasm skulker! The neck dome's connected to the fat bone. What's the neck dome? Got him. I guess you did. Wrecked. This guy's super dead. You think our chasm skulker is return a creature, return an artifact. So you're getting back the twig and the mold graft scavenger. You got it, man. Have fun. <laughs> God, Hunter, you're being real loud. I took him out. I guess that was a couple hours ago. No, he's just excited about life. The neck bones connected to the 
Mike Bone. Unfortunately, even Fogbringer is pretty bad with this Bow of Nylea in play. Mm. What? Hey, man. What? Thinking about getting some sushi tomorrow. Oh, yeah? You want it? Maybe. What time? Well, we'd have to do it before stream. Yeah. So uh, I think get up around like 1130. I could do that. Yeah, the door at 12. Out the door at 12. I could do that. All right. Don't tell me what to do. I'll do it. Okay. Calm down. Calm no, down. don't don't tell me what don't I can't me. do. <laughs> there you go. Don't tell me what I can't do. That's John Locke from a little show called Lost. <laughs> what is he inviting you to? Nothing. It's a joke because of that post I made where I'm like, oh, if right. you live like 10 hours oh, yeah, away yeah. from me and I've never met you, can you just not invite me to your Facebook stuff? No offense. I like you guys. I'm just not going to make it. If you emailed me, if you were like, hey, I'd really like you to come to this thing. Let's see if we can get work. I'd be like, okay, let's let's check it out. But if you just send me a random invite to like something in like Michigan or De I guess the same place. Uh, Do you say Detroit? <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, it's the same place. Um, I'm just going to be like, I'm probably not going to make it. Four, five, six, seven, eight. So we can play this, have two counter spells at the ready. I think this game is way over. Hmm. Do you even care about that? Now watch me whip. They have one card in hand though, so I mean, just, like you can just bounce it though. Why? Why counter it? We okay. have ten perms. I think we do, right? Oh god, if we get to put this on top, yeah, we definitely because we eight, nine, ten. Oh wow, that's brutal. Yeah, it's way better than countering it actually. I think he's just dead now. Yeah, they are because they're gonna redraw that. And what their last card in hand? I can't imagine it matters. But you don't want to join the Mages Guild of Tampa. I live in Tampa, so, I mean, that's close. Oh, no. Does that matter? I don't know. They take 10 here and go to 8, and then they get another 3 to go to 11, so 8, 9, 10, 11. No, that's actually exactly lethal. That's pretty hilarious. Now watch me whip. Now watch me nay nay. That dude has... Why'd you let that resolve? Because I, I thought this would kill it. Oh. I've made mistakes. Well, magic is a hard game. It really is. Now watch me whip. And watch me nay nay. Yep. We gave them one extra turn, but it doesn't matter because we have two counter spells still. So you get, yeah, but that only works if you remember to play them. That's fair. <laughs> Mm, Touche, I see, I see. All right, let's try this again, Frank. Now All he's right. going to play a blocker. Oh, he conceded. We're good. Dang it, it's like they knew. All right, we are 2-0 so far. I'm liking it. My friend is opening a game shop in Mansfield, Texas. Come on down for some $10 drafts. Deal. I'll see you later. I feel like if I came down there and you were still charging me for $10 drafts, I think, I think we'd have a little bit of an issue. This hand seems fine. We can whip and nay nay to get the things we need. Oh look, Robert! I didn't know you were still alive, buddy. I haven't oh, seen you in like a month. What up, boy? Ooh, super aggro. Is it super aggro? It kind of looks like medium aggro to me, man.
<laughs> Hope you'll make it. Um, uh, is that like in Russia or something? I don't know where that is. Wow, never. They missed the land drop, and we we got we got there, boys. Ooh, he's provoking you. That's actually pretty good. I feel be I feel worse about this now that I forgot that this guy existed. I I am not. All we had to do was ultimate price that guy, and our guy would have went the distance. I think. Wow. Yeah, that was pretty bad. I didn't I, think of that either. I didn't think about it. I didn't, I totally forgot that guy had an ability. Yeah, that's fine. All right, if we can go swamp into something else, we're good. We get to do the dis do do the distance deed. Oh, cycle areno. That is not what we're looking for here. He's probably just gonna die this two one. It's not out of the realm of possibility. Like it's very hard to deal with. Wall of Denial. That's pretty annoying. Yeah, I agree with you. Wow, I don't have anything to do about that. Okay, okay, we're getting there. A Force Spike? <laughs> Did I try to get in there? We have bounce, bounce, bounce. <laughs> I knew you were gonna do it. I think we're expel is probably better than regress by a good deal. Like this is just an eight turn clock, which is not nothing, but it is a little slow. But so are you, you know? So <sighs> I know. God, that that Chasm Skulker probably would have done it. That's yeah, like, that would that would have been. Pretty, he's pretty good. Like he's pretty hard. At, like you have to have hard removal for him. Lose some blue white. Hmm. Ninja of the deepest hours. Now you can crew his thing. I'm really looking for that pinger. Yeah, I'll crew in response, you see. I think we actually just trade here. Yeah, we have to trade here. Oh, uh, actually, they're just going to block, aren't they? I imagine they block with the 08, but who knows? 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, 08, Remember that song? I know that, Jim. Okay. That was written about Wall of Denali now. Hmm. Didn't know that. Prevent all combat damage you dealt to this. All right. Yeah, well, I'm just going to kill that. going to straight up murder you. It's straight up murder. Get the bounce of land to your hand too. All the tempo swings here, boy. 
Hey, Mike, doesn't it feel good when the squishy mic touches the tip of your nose? Yes, it does. Boop, boop, boop. I can't tell a lie. You can't tell a lie? Mm-hmm. That's cool, bro. Can't attack. It's being your upkeep. You gain a life. Sure, that's pretty obnoxious. I'm just going to bounce it to my hand. Actually... Let's bounce these two and we can replay this guy and kill and, and bounce another one of their lands. Oh, we can't do that this turn though. No. I guess that's I guess we'll just go uh Arctic is pretty sick. All right, that'll do. Man, Wall of Denial is pretty obnoxious. There's really nothing you can do about it. Outside of countering it. There is nothing you can do about the wall. And again, it doesn't kill anything, so... Actually, Master Thief seems pretty good here. What do they have? Uh, the Sky Skiff. Oh, sure. Sky skiff. Oh, this hand is really bad. Uh huh. Mm, better. Yeah, I'll keep you. Man, I really should have ponder. All I ever want is a ponder. Ponderio. Mike Sullivan still paying attention to the game? I just won the last round. I don't understand what that means. Why don't you just pay attention, okay? I'm sorry. God. Unless you're referring to chat. Mike, what's your favorite game of all time? Uh, probably Metal Gear Solid 1. Wow, 1 for like NES? I said Metal Gear Solid. Oh, Metal Gear Solid, not Metal Gear. Touche. 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 Touchy. Man, Police Hawk does it again. <laughs> this card's actually very good as well. I guess that game is considered old school now. said no blocks it's gonna be the seraph yep oh that was pretty dumb Where's our Doom Blade at? Where my D Blade at? We got an ultimate price, which is very similar.
Sure. for you. Police hawk first. I dare you. This is an emotional roller coaster. Water, not water, not gonna happen to me. We got a ton of flyers too, so I don't know why we're not drawing our flyers here. Swamp would have been nice. Agreed. that one turn clock boy we got to figure out a way to deal with this angel of the sword that'll do it we're good at this game all right lethal Mike, I'm going to keep hitting you with questions. What do you do day to day now? What's your thing now? My thing now? Uh, I work for a company called FIS. I do fraud support. He supports fraud. Do you hear that? Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you could take it that way. It's the only way to take it, man. Outside of that, I just built a new commander deck, so that's pretty cool. Going to be playing that tomorrow. So they got a block with something. Uh, Robert, there's a uh, commander on Thursdays at shortstops. I built Sidisi, the Brood Tyrant. Make all of the Zombo tokens and turn them sideways. That is true. I do have six jalapeno children. <laughs> that is correct. Uh, it's for pods or one v one. I guess it's more of a pod deck. Mike, do you like Marin as a commander? Marin, what's that Marin do again? I forget. I guess you don't then, do you? Wow. Marin sounds familiar. Would you consider switching to Esper Zomboys? No, because the deck isn't like focused on on being zombies. It just happens to make zombie tokens. It's not like a zombie tribal deck.
Oh my god, you have to block or else you're dead. Yeah, Thursday is Commander Pods, yes. Uh, typically, there's just a bunch of people show up and play Commander and Pods. Water Servant doing some serious work in this matchup. Also, this ultimate price was quite timely. Oh, Marin. Yeah, Marin's pretty good. Infinite Frog Spawns. Frog Spore. Frog Spawn Spores. Marin of Clan Neltoth. Well, I can crew and double block, but then I get to take both of them out. And then they're left with 1-1 one, one while we have Unus Prowler. Uh, I don't play Endless Ranks for the Dead Net. The main way to win is to get filth in the graveyard with a bunch of zombie tokens and Urborg out. So everyone has swamps. They can't block. If that doesn't work. You can always play Crater with Behemoth and attack for like a billion. Maybe you can. I'll try. Maybe you'll try. Did you catch any fraudsters yet? Yeah, I've definitely caught a bunch of fraudsters. Man, if you hadn't and you've been working there this long, I feel like they're just wasting money. Well, it's mostly just talking people to verify whether they their transactions on their credit cards are fraud or not, which is pretty much most calls is someone getting frauded. Give us an excellent commander story. Uh, I mean, I won with... Uh, Army of the Damned and taking a bunch of extra turns off of uh, not even my own take extra turn effects, my opponents, because I had uh, Spell Twine, and then my opponent also had a Spell Twine in the graveyard, so I Spell Twine to get an extra turn and use his Spell Twine to get another extra turn. So that was pretty cool. Yeah, I think we just lost this game. Well, we had a good run. I think we were pretty much out of this as soon as we, like... Just didn't hit anything that would have been a good draw this turn, but. You play Gadok Teague as your commander? Oh, God. Made a prison deck? Yeah. Nah, no one's going to want to play with you very long. <laughs> Sorry about your friends, bro. Like, I, Stax is a viable archetype and all, but, like, you're not going to make friends playing that. And it'd be fair if you're not playing stacks, Teague just keeps people honest, but. Get off Teague, and the taste of your Teague. Teague's toxic. That was a good draw. Rob, are you going to come up and play some hippo? Starts around six, I believe. Wow. Oh, Smuggler's Copter. Wow, I did not notice that. I thought that was just a Sky Skiff. Give me a Thief. Give me a Thief. Well, he ain't got any friends yet. I guess that's true. No. No. Let me see them long legs, boy. Did you like that? Yeah. Okay. That's cool, dude. Man, he gets to draw a card? How busted. And discard, too. Pequels are dumb. Pequels? Said vehicles. Pequels? (sighs) 
Would you entertain a question regarding your choice of seating? I'm in the market for a new office chair. What you got, man? Uh, I have a an Aaron by Herman Miller. So, I mean, if you're looking for an office chair, it's probably the highest possible recommendation. But uh, just because Obliterator is way above the curve in modern doesn't mean it's not. I mean, you can fatal push it by cracking a fetch land. You can dismember it, which kills it pretty easily. You can terminate it. All of the removal path. deals with it pretty. You can path it. Every piece of removal in modern that's commonly played is very, very easy to get rid of a, an obliterator. And the requirement to be four black is extremely high for that format. Um, it basically means you have to play mono black. Yeah, like your return on investment is just not high enough. Is there kale jerky for vegetarians? I don't think so. I would wager no. Oh, that's pretty good. Crew, crew. Thanks for all these one man one one crew cards, wizards. Yeah, one mana crew is pretty ridiculous. Well, one tough one power crew, I mean, crew one. Yeah. That's what I mean. This is aggressive. Oh yeah, we're 100 percent blocking this guy. That was a good draw. Yo, I can have this. Ba -do 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 -do. Ba -do 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 -do. Want to hear a great joke? Kaladesh balance. <laughs> Hi, oh, funny. Funny joke. It's a good one. It's a solid strat. Oh, you're just going to draw three. That's fine. That's basically a worse opportunity. Oh. Still pretty good, though. No, it's terrible. Just like your life. Wow. Got him. Well, I never. No, you had. You have. I never. You have. Hey. God, why are you so weird all the time? You know, that's a good question. They didn't even attack. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, we know. You're Mr. Bucket, okay? I'm Mr. Bucket. Put the balls in my top. I'm actually going to crew this with this gentleman. And if you want to trade for like one of these, totally cool, dude. Toad's cool, bro. However, I don't want to trade with both of these. So let's get my loot on. My looty tootie. I wonder what we eat here. The Sky Skiff or the Talon Trooper? Probably. Oh. You just take it. Interesting. Well, I'll be. Do you keep Tyrannic Vision up or even Fog? I feel burn? like we keep Counterspell up. Yeah, I agree. We I kind of actually want to play this. No, we don't. No, we're, we're one we're shy because if we draw a land next turn, we can do both. Like, if they actually end up attacking for two and putting us to eight, I'd be quite surprised. Oh, yeah. No. Yep, that was pretty good. Bull day. They have three blockers. 
The blocks are pretty bad. Hmm. Maybe I just actually loot and discard that guy if it comes down to it. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like random foggy boy is worse than ponder here. Yep. I think we get her with the, with the bird. Because the other guy's always going to take up a, a thing. Oh, water servant and recover? Oh, yes. Keep these. So we're going to go one, two. Oh, I want it the other way. Dang it, I hate that so much. No, don't shuffle. I'll just play Water Serpent because it's a big boy. Pretty sure we win this round. <laughs> yep, don't actually care about you. For all combat damage that would be dealt to it, that's obnoxious. It's a very good blocker. It's a good boy. What do we have in here? Nested ghoul. Fogbringer. What are we drawing off this? Do we know? Uh, swamp. Was it? Yeah. The last card you put on top was swamp. Or rather, the first card you put on top. Oh, actually, what if they go to kill the Master Thief and then we can just get it back with the Recover? That seems pretty good. Scrambled eggs. Yep, yep, I take... I was like, does this kill you? Three, four, five, six. All right. Are you dead to water servant? You have one card. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? You're it's taking so long, man. Just either answer it or die. I only got one card. I don't understand. It's not much to think about here. Tap target untapped creature control. If you do, it deals damage equal to its power to target attacking or blocking creature an opponent controls. Okay. So, one, two, three. Play this guy again next turn. Or we can just play a, a fencer click here, which is actually pretty good. So, we'll pump you one more. All right, well. Be Fernie, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. I got Tiga pizza I ordered. I really had to debate getting one with pineapple on it. It was a swamp. It's like I knew. Oh, and that's the game. Once we steal that sky skiff, we don't really worry. We're just thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons if you enjoy the content. If you don't enjoy the content, slam them anyway. I don't. Know. The next one will be better. I promise. <laughs> Check me out on Patreon and on Twitch. Links are both in the description below. If you want to support me in other ways, I really appreciate it. Uh, thank you guys, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>